pundits are saying that your defeat today is down to a simple tactical change by by Arsenal. Do you think it was more complicated, a bit more deep than that? Well, he, they played uh, quite similar that uh, he's playing the last uh, last period. He makes some movements. Uh, well, it was quite similar the, the game we played against against Liverpool, for example, last one or against Tottenham, and um, and uh, yeah, that's all. So we didn't we didn't we didn't do we didn't make a good performance. Uh, we can lose the game. Only regret is we didn't play the first half, but we played the second one and. In this kind of level, in this kind of semi-finals, finals, um, you have to make a good performance. And today we didn't do it. Sometimes happen. Did you have any complaints over the penalty claim in the second half? Raheem certainly looked as if he felt he was fouled. I, I didn't do it. I didn't do it. I, I didn't do it. I didn't see it. So, so I don't know. How disappointing is it today? I mean, it's two and a half years since you lost a, a cup tie domestically. But sometimes happen. Sometimes, uh, you know, you lost an incredible run, but sometimes lost. Yeah, but you can lost. So, football game, you can lost it. But the way we lost, especially in the first half, that is what uh, we are sad about this. Hi, Pep. Hi. Um, you mentioned quite a few specific things yesterday in terms of set pieces and um, concentration and throw-ins and all these small details that need to come together to win in the semi-final was it those kind of details today or do you do you think there was another reason another no. bigger reason for the, for the defeat no 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 the details in general we were there in the throw-ins and the corners and whatever we were the situations they didn't play the first half uh, we struggled to play we struggled to be there in the game in the semi-finals of FA Cup and that's why that's why that's why we lost the game so if you have played the first half in the way we approach and the aggressive and the, the desire to win in the first half like the second half, the game maybe would have been different, but we could not do it. Why was that? Why were those problems in the first half? Was that a fault with your own team no, because Arsenal was so good? No, we didn't. We, we were not good. We didn't play good. So it's as simple as that. It's more difficult to find it. So these players have shown many, many things in the right moments and today in the first half we were not ready. Sorry, just one more. Could, just because you mentioned yesterday about this would be like a mental test for the Real Madrid game, especially in a way kind of set up for this inevitable question. If you you know, if you play so well so often, but in this in this case not so well, are you reading anything actually into what might happen for the Madrid game? Is this gonna be a lesson for you to remind the players before that game? They have to. I don't have to tell them. They have to know it. They felt it. They they feel it. I think so. So we know the standards that we have to be in these kind of stages in these kind of competitions. And uh, maybe we will learn it or maybe not. So we will see. So the last game against Bournemouth was not good, and and today the first half was not good. So and and we struggle we struggle to to play in uh, in our level and we know so it's not necessary to say a genius to realize that uh, we have to increase our stand against Madrid if we want to have any chance to, to go through.